Peterson was the principal of Fairview Elementary School, and she believed in rules. She used them to teach hygiene, to control behavior, and to instill order. Yes, Mrs. Peterson believed in rules. She also believed that those who didn't follow them should be punished. Okay, the camera is rolling. Are there any words you'd like to say before your daughter makes her stage debut? Let us pray. Gabby, Juanita is going to see this. Oh, trust me, this is not footage you're going to want to keep. Well, I'm sorry. I tried to work with her. But you may as well know your daughter is talent-free. She is only seven. How bad could she be? Well, I've already looked through the program to pick out a kid we can pretend is ours. I like Paige Glover. I'm going to be her mommy. My name is Miles Standish. We have come to share with you our bounty. And to give thanks for this new land where we are free from religious Perskakushin. <laughs> Which one is Paige Glover? Religious Perskakushin. Um, where we are free from religious persecution. Read the corn. I wrote it in the corn. Perska Prasa. Ah. At that moment, Juanita Solis chose to utter a certain four-letter word for the very first time. I did not write that on the corn. And as punishment, I'm having Juanita draft a letter of apology to every classmate and family member who heard the verb in question. That seems fair. And of course, you won't be allowed to participate in the final two performances of the Thanksgiving pageant. Of course. And she is also on cafeteria cleaning detail for the next two weeks? Absolutely. Uh, not so fast. I'm sorry. Oh, come on, Mrs. Peterson. A letter of apology, fine. Taking her out of the play, hey, she deserved that based on her performance alone. But let's not go overboard. Mrs. Solis. This school has a zero-tolerance policy when it comes to profanity. And we respect that, right, honey? Stay out of this, sweetheart. You need to take a second look at that policy. Juanita made a little slip. It wasn't intentional. It's not like she flipped the bird afterwards. My ruling stands. If you can't do the time, don't do the crime. What is this, Shawshank Elementary? This school is not at fault. If you want to assign blame, you might look to your dubious parenting skills. Oh, I wish you hadn't said that. Excuse me? Well, Juanita learned that word somewhere. And you're saying I taught it to her? No, I'm sure it was whispered to her by the wind. <laughs> Let me tell you something, Miss Peterson. I am pulling Juanita out of this crappy, crappy school. Come on, Carlos. Oh. Crappy, huh? What a shame Juanita won't be here to blurt that out during the Pledge of Allegiance. Oh, yeah? Well, here's a blurt for you. And the horse you rode in on. 